Hi Group A, it's Mrs. Slagle. Hopefully you're having a great day. We are doing Lesson 44 in SIPs. You need your SIPs binder. And we'll be turning to Story 44. And we're going to start off with some listening games. Okay, here we go. We're going to rhyme. Rhyme with et. Mm. Rhyme with met. Rhyme with let. Mm. Good. Let's try another rhyme. Rhyme with ub. Er. Rhyme with rub. S. Rhyme with sub. T. Great job. All right. We're all right. We're going to add some sounds now. Sorry about that. Okay. Say at, add er word. Say at, add s word. Say at, add m word. Good. If you said rat, sat, and mat, you are correct. Listen to this word, man. The first sound is m. Mm. The last part is an. We call an a rhyme. Listen to another word, pan. The first part is p. The last part is an. An is the rhyme. Listen to pet. The first word, the first sound is p. The rhyme is et. Let's do one more. Listen to the word let. The first part is l. The second part is et. And we call that the rhyme. Words are rhyming if the rhyme is, they sound the same. Okay, let's do some blending. Ready? E sh blend. Er a sh blend. U e sh blend. Sh a p blend. Sh a t blend. Last one. Sh e p blend. Right. I heard the sound sh a lot in those words, and that is our new sound. Here is our sound sentence. Listen. When I say hush to the baby, she stops crying. Our new sound is sh. S h. Practice. Shh. Sound. 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 This has two sounds. Z and th. Z and th. Sound. 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 Sound, 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 sound. Great job. Hopefully all those sounds popped into your brain. Let's take those sounds and put them together to sound out some words. Here we go. Sounds. Read. Check. Fish. Sounds. Read. Check. Rash. Sounds. Read. Check. Wish. Sounds. Read, check, shop.
sounds. Read, check, ship. Sounds, read, check, shut. Sounds, read, check, mash. Sounds, read, check, shell. Sounds, read, check, van. Sounds, read, check, well. Sounds, read, check, them. Sounds, read, check, thick. Okay, great job. All right. We have two new sight words. Listen to our sight word sentences. Listen. Where were you? Read. Where were you? New sight word is were. It looks a lot like where. Were. Listen. I could not find you. Read. I could not find you. The sight word is could. Were and could. Okay. Our new sight word is could. Read. Spell. Read. New sight word is were. Read. Spell. Read. All right, let's review our words that we just had earlier this week. The sight word is your, read, spell, read. New sight word is very, read, spell, read. All right, here we go. Read, 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 read. Read, 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 read. How about we do these all together super quickly? Okay, ready, set, go. Could, were, your, very, again, many, people. Find, from, for, want, water, over, there, look, be, says, say. If some of those words were tricky for you, go ahead and re-watch that part of the video until these sight words pop into your brain like popcorn. Could and were are our new sight words, could and were. Read, read. Okay, good job. All right, let's get ready to read our story together. Turn to lesson 44, the pet fish part one. There is a very tricky word in this story, but we're going to sound it out. And it's not tricky if we sound it out. Are you ready? Here we go. Sounds. P -u -a -s -t -ic. Hmm. Let's put that word together. Plastic. Read plastic. Good job. Okay, here we go. Point to the title. The pet fish part one. Hmm. Remember that we have the different paragraphs. We're gonna, whenever I see, we come to a new paragraph, I will say read. We're gonna be mindful of punctuation and commas, so we're gonna pause when we see those things. Okay, ready, read. Sam and Anne want some pet fish. They get in the van with dad. Read. Here they are at the pet shop. The pet shop sells fish 
dogs, and cats. Read, there are lots of fish. Red fish, black fish, and pink fish. Read, there are big fish and little fish. The little fish swim fast. Read, Anne and Sam like a little red fish. Anne wants a big black fish. Read, Sam wants a fish that is big and pink. Dad gets all three fish. Read, the man in the pet shop puts the fish in a bag. It is a, there's that tricky word, plastic bag. Read, then dad gets them a big fish tank. They all go home in the van. All right, great job. Here are the two questions. I'm gonna say the question, then I want you to pause the video and underline where you found the text evidence. Okay, here we go. Question number one, what is the story about? Go ahead and pause the video and reread until you find the sentence that best tells what the story is about. Okay, so let me share with you what I underlined. I underline the very first sentence that tells us what the story is about. Sam and Anne want some pet fish. So I underline the first sentence in the first paragraph. Did you underline it too? Okay, question number two. How many fish do Sam and Anne get and what are they like? Pause the video. Go through and see if you can find Okay, so I underline lots of different parts because we know that Anne and Sam like a little red fish. Anne wants a big black fish and Sam wants a fish that is big and pink. And then how many fish did they get? It says right here, dad gets all three fish. Okay, question three. How do they take the fish home and why don't they use the tank? Pause the video. All right. I underlined the, very, the second to last paragraph. It tells us the man in the pet shop puts the fish in a bag. It's a plastic bag. So that's how they get the fish home. And the fish did not go home in the tank because dad gets them a big fish tank. So they have the tank and the fish separately. Okay, in part two, they're gonna be setting up the fish tank. We'll be reading that story next week. Boys and girls, please reread this story three more times. Please be mindful when there are underlined words, those are your sight words, they need to pop into your brain. All the other words are decodable, so sound them out. When you come to a word, sound it out, right? Like this, we would go p, et, pet, sh, op, shop. Okay, good luck. Be sweet and be kind and have a great day.